I've spent most of my life watching addiction in the lives of people that I know and love. And here's what I've observed. Number one, addiction is a liar. When a person meets addiction, addiction promises a lot of things. Addiction promises a good time, but they end up with bad times. Addiction promises stress relief and relaxation, but they end up with more stress. They end up with depression, anxiety, paranoia. Addiction promises a high, and yet they end up brought down and very low. Not only is addiction a liar, addiction is a thief. Someone comes to addiction for the purpose of using, and yet they end up being used. Slowly but surely, addiction begins to take away everything a person has. Addiction will take away their money, their job, their career. Addiction will take away relationships, marriages, with children, families. Addiction will take away reputations. Addiction will take away one's dignity. They find themselves doing things that they never dreamed they ever would. Addiction takes away one's health. Addiction is a liar, addiction is a thief, and addiction is also a murderer. After addiction has broken every promise, after addiction have, has taken everything, it will turn on the addict to take their very life. You know, they say addiction is a disease, and I know it's not politically correct, but I don't believe that it is. You see, as I said, I grew up around addiction from an early age as a child, and if it is a disease, it's not contagious because I never caught it. I don't believe addiction is a disease. I believe addiction is of the devil. And here's why. As I've observed, addiction is a liar, addiction is a thief, Addiction is a murderer. In John's gospel, Jesus says, Satan, the devil, is a liar and the father of lies. In John 10, Jesus says, the thief, Satan, the devil, he comes to steal, to kill, and destroy. Jesus also says that Satan is a murderer. He was a murderer from the very beginning. And Jesus is the only one who has ever defeated the devil. He did so on the cross. And today, if you're struggling with addiction, he offers you a way out. He offers you hope. He offers you victory over the devil who's using addiction to destroy your life. I encourage you today, turn to the Lord. He will set you free.